Ridgeway. Ridgeway is serving a life sentence for the murder of 49 women. Investigators believe he killed dozens more. In May, Ridgeway was transferred from the Washington State Penitentiary in Walla Walla to a federal maximum security prison in Colorado. That decision triggered complaints from victims' families and from Representative Reichert, who was the lead investigator on the Green River murder case. Those complaints ended up getting Ridgeway transferred back to Washington just weeks later. Today, the Secretary of Corrections said the move was purely for security reasons. We really referred him to ADX as a matter of increasing the security around Gary Ridgeway and increasing the, uh, the, mitigating the possibility that he could e either escape or potentially harm our staff. He's a coward. He attacked 15-year-old girls from behind and choked them to death. He's not going to attack a prison guard. It was the three hardest days of my life, to tell you the truth. Um, but that's the kind of thing that you have to do. The victims come first. The families come first. The people who are tied to this case and have the images of those scenes mm -hmm. should be the highest consideration, not this monster. What happens is, of course, visions of him playing shuffleboard and poker in prison is not a vision that the families or the investigators really uh, appreciate. Your mindset that night, I gotta kill somebody? Yeah. As we go by where Kings was, you know what Yeah, he wants to just take a try. I enjoyed our talk today. Okay. Did you? Yes, I did. Why did I hate him? Because I. They, uh, women had control over me, and I don't like being controlled. And I got my rage out for the time. Ridgeway was finally arrested uh, and, uh, and pled guilty and went off to prison. The families felt like, and so did the investigators, that justice had been served.